Local Assemblyman Randy Vopel is being accused of stolen valor. A Republican rival and a Navy veteran says the former mayor of Santee misrepresented his military service record. But as our investigative reporter Jennifer Kastner found out, there is no hard proof yet to back up those claims. This is serious business. It's a slap in the face to veterans. Accusations of stolen valor Monday as Navy veteran and Republican State Assembly candidate Larry Wilski addressed the media by the USS Midway. Joined by private investigator and veteran Terrence Hoy, they launched an attack against GOP incumbent and Navy veteran Randy Vopel. He's not a Purple Heart recipient, although he has repeatedly stated that he is, and his chief of staff has doubled down on this claim. They're also alleging that Vopel, the former mayor of Santee, falsely claimed combat experience in Vietnam. But documents sent to us by Vopel's staff show he served on the USS Buchanan and was awarded a ribbon for combat action, along with other Vietnam awards. The Wilski camp believes it's forged. This document has been altered, thus rendering the form essentially void. As for claims of a Purple Heart, Vopel staff denies they ever said he had one. 10 News couldn't find proof of such claims anywhere. And a military service record provided by Wilski doesn't include a Purple Heart. Wilski and his supporters say there's multiple credible witness testimonies and video evidence that'll reveal the whole truth, but they have yet to be fully produced. Regardless, Wilski and Hoy deny that this is all political mudslinging. The one thing that we can't square here is that round peg with Vopel and his wild and comedic claims. Now, there was one alleged witness at today's meeting, a veteran who says Vopel lied to his face about his service history. However, Vopel's staff says they don't know if the two have ever actually met each other. We asked Vopel for a sit-down interview. He declined. He denies all the allegations about stolen valor. Jennifer Kastner, 10 News.